Project Architect here, and today I'm going to teach you how to make a sloped roof in Revit. So first let's get started by drawing a normal roof, and then I'll teach you how to make it sloped. So if we come over here and choose our roof selection, three, and we'll choose just a generic 125 millimeter roof. Now let's create an offset of 400 millimeters, and I've just selected the select line tool here. So you'll see that that line is selecting the edge of my wall, and that dotted line is my offset. So I'll select all of my wall around here like so. Click OK, yes, and I'll have a look in 3D. So this is your generic plum cut roof at a 30 degree pitch. So to make it sloped, you double click into it and edit footprint again. You can do this in 3D or 2D. I prefer 3D. And you'll see these little slope symbols on each line. So these symbols are defined slope. Basically, if you have the defined slope, it creates a slope down to that line. So if you want to just slope your roof from this line up to this line here, you select that, keep it as defined slope, and get rid of all the other ones. So now this line only will be the downside of your roof and the rest of it will be pitching upwards. So I click OK, we'll have a look at that. Alright, so that's quite steep at 30 degree slope, so we'll knock it down a bit to maybe a 5 degree slope. And that'll give us a slight pitch in our roof. So this works with any style of roof, any roof in Revit you can choose from. And if you want a little bit of a unique slope, you could have this one defining the slope as well. So now both these lines will be in the downturn side, and these lines will be in the up. Click OK again. And you'll see our roof has sloped down like that, moving up to these lines over here. Let's go back on that. So you can change and edit your roof with the slope in it and it'll change to a warm roof, concrete, or a warm roof timber, anything like that. Thank you guys, I'm Project Architect, see you next video.